What a magnum amazing Thursday morning it is. Today is 10 12 2023. And as I was doing my evening devotion, what came to me was thankful. Colossians 3:17 says, "And whatever you do or say, do it as a representative of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks through him to God the Father." So my question to you is what impression do people have of Christ when they see or talk with you? When you walk away, what are they saying about Christ because of you as his representative? What changes could you make in your life in order to honor Christ? Colossians 2 7 says, let your roots grow down into him and let your lives be built on him. Then your faith will grow strong in the truth you were taught and you will overflow with thankfulness. So just as soil provide nourishment to plants through roots deep into the ground, the Lord Jesus Christ gives us strength to move the more we grow closer to him pray read meditate meditate read pray meditate pray read on the word of the lord on a daily basis the closer that we grow to god the less you are misled about other falsehoods throughout the world just remember you want your trunk to be strong. And the way that you're going to do that is you're going to stay in the word of the Lord, the living water. And through him, he is going to strengthen you. He is going to provide that water to your soil in order for you to grow. Second Corinthians 9, 12 says, so two things will result from this ministry of giving. The need of the believers in Jerusalem will be met and they will joyfully express their thanks to God. See, your actions that you do on a daily basis causes others to give thanks to the Lord because of what you are doing. You are being obedient to the will of God. So continue to be obedient to the will of God. You just give thanks and be grateful for what he's doing in your life. And when you pray, you meditate on his word, you allow him to be to allow you to give thanks to others because of things that you do. Ephesians 5.20 And give thanks for everything to God the Father in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. So, be thankful when life gets you down. Be strong in faith, knowing that the Lord will take care of you. He will lift you up out of a storm and he will give you the desires of your heart. He just wants you to put all of your trust in him to be thankful. Be a representative of the Lord for in your daily activities. Show him by your reading, by your praying and your meditating on his word that you have given your complete trust and faith in him. And show him off to others. Just like when you used to go to school, you had show and tell. You can have show and tell every day of your life. When you step out into the world and you tell others about the Lord Jesus and the goodness that he is doing in your life. Get out a pen and some paper and write it down daily. Things that you are grateful for. Things that he has done in your life. Things that he will do in your life. Because you trust and you believe in the promises that he has made to you. i leave you with this. Add three things to your list every single day that you are thankful for. That you are grateful for. And watch that list grow. See, God is an awesome God. And he will give you the desires of your heart if you be thankful each and every day. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Have a magnum amazing day. Be legendary. And our purpose is your blessing.